If you look over on the left side of the primary flight display, or PFD, or the multifunction display, or MFD, there is a heading knob or a heading selection knob that has the label HDG right above it. This is short for heading and corresponds to the heading bug located on the horizontal situation indicator within the primary flight display or PFD. When you rotate the knob to the right, the heading bug moves around the HSI to the right. If you rotate the knob to the left, the heading bug moves around the HS side to the left. If you press the heading knob, the heading bug will jump to your current heading. You can use the heading knob to control which heading you want the Skyhawk to go. Let's take a look at how this works in flight. First, make sure the autopilot is on as indicated by AP in the PFD. Next, we are going to set the heading using the heading knob to the initial desired heading. So I'm going to rotate the knob so that the heading is 359 degrees or almost due north, and due north is 360 degrees. Next, I need to first activate the heading feature by pressing the HDG key on the left side of the MFD. Notice when I do this that HDG appears at the top of the PFD, and if the autopilot is activated, the plane will turn to that heading. If you press the HDG key and notice the plane doesn't turn, Chances are the autopilot is not activated, so press the AP key to activate it. Whether the plane turns to the right or to the left is based on which turn is the quickest way to get to the desired heading. Now with heading and the autopilot both on, if we rotate the knob to the left, the plane will follow the heading bug by turning to the left until it catches up with the heading bug. If we rotate the knob to the right, the plane will turn to the right until it catches up again with the heading bug. Subscribe to this channel to learn more.